Yeah, this is W.E. Du Bois. It's just like the print over there. And this is the fun thing about printmaking, especially the ones that are done by hand. The unique thing about a print is that uh, they look the same, but once you begin collecting prints, you realize that each one is uniquely different. It's a very small difference. Then this one is just like uh, Eve at the top, uh, and it's just slightly different. This, is, this color is a little deeper, and uh, the black is just a little bit darker, but they're the same prints. How do you uh, select both of these the, are wood blocks. How do you select the colors that you use on those prints? Uh, purely intuitive. Mm -hmm. It's all feeling. It's all feeling. Sometimes there's more than the feeling. There may be, in the case of this one with Mandela, um, these colors appeared more indigenous to the kind of colors that you see in the South African uh, art culture. Mm -hmm. And so um, uh, they may have some meaning like that. What about those floral prints that you have in the front of your work? Yes. Uh, these are relief prints and paper prints. Uh, these, these are uh, pansies, and this is a technique uh, that, of course, instead of wooden plates or metal plates, I'm using paper plates, mm -hmm. and that's a technique of my own. I'm, I'm sure I didn't invent it because uh, newspapers are printed from paper plates. It's you, just molded paper plates. You also mentioned that you do collage, Mr. Jones. Um, do you have any samples of collage in in the uh, print rack or in yes, the wall? Yes, here, 